I'm, oh, Jesus. Hey, sorry about your stomach there, guy. I know you're probably full on weird glyphs, but... I, I, I took those glyphs. They're mine now. You can't have them. Heh. Oh, there's a wall here. I'll get away. Somehow. You're welcome. And welcome back to Mr. Red Play's Canarium. <laughs> These are uh, fun little things you can do to intro an episode. It's just kind of... Wait a second. Was that thing looking that way the whole time? I feel like this thing was looking over there a second ago. And now it's following me. I might not be right about that. But I feel like that thing was just following me. Ah, that's very annoying. Uh, that's freaky. I don't like a lot of what this game is doing in terms of its scariness. Because it scares me. Case in point, this plant that we established as being a problem before. And that pentagram on top of the weird shape. This whole thing is very spooky. I'm just gonna pop on through, don't worry about me. Oh, God, no. Oh, there's a lot of this plant stuff, isn't there? These ivy-like plants are blocking the way. You can't just duck under there? Is that not, uh, just pop on down? I don't think I have a crouch button. Hmm. Weird. Uh, I don't have a crouch button, I don't have a jump button. What can you do? Oh, I can do that. <laughs> uh, what's this gonna do? Is this possibly going... Oh, you know what? I bet this is gonna rotate that light, and it's gonna aim it in different directions. For example... Oh, right in there. Wait, right in there with the plant. Just got a feeling. Well, let's keep looking, though, because there's, there's, there's more to explore. No, there's not. That's where I came in. Okay, great. <laughs> I'll just uh, return back here, and I will rotate. Yes, dude. Not that way. Oh, I guess it worked, huh? So... Oh, now it's... I'm mean, at this. Is it doing anything to it, though? Doesn't seem to be. All right, keep going. More. D do more. Do, do better. I want more. Give it to me. Yes. This is what I want. Boom. Hey, it's working. I knew it. I knew it. I'm a smart boy. I'm a smart boy. Is that it? There's still plant there. Well, I guess it's kind of just cleared out. All right, cool. So now I'm in here. I don't really know where I'm going or what I'm looking for. I mean, just other people. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's alien. Oh, and I don't like these uh, uh, little whatevers. So I, I mentioned alien earlier. This is very alien. I'm going to get face huggered for sure. And in the new movies, there's all like this spores and stuff flying around. And there's, I don't like this. It's just all, oh, and there's a skull with fangs. There's a skull with fangs. I don't like any of this. This is a problem. I don't have any weapons, by the way. So if I get face hugged, there's just no hope for me. That's true in, in, in life as well as the game. Because I don't think I would be, I don't think I would do well in an alien situation. <laughs> I, I, I just feel, I just got that feeling, you know what I mean? I, I think everybody has an idea how well they do in various apocalypse, which is a word. Uh, not me. I would not do well. I would, I'd be one of the first to go, I think. I'd like hole up in a bunker somewhere, and then there would just be some weird blast, and I would just go flying. So it, there's no hope for me. Oh, no, it's a figure. Oh, that's exactly what I didn't want it to be. Uh-oh, it's a figure. It's got arms. Oh, God, no, it's got hands and a head. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez, oh, oh, no, it's phasing. Oh, it's phasing. No, it's fine, actually. Wait, I'm phasing. Why is everything all staticky? Last time this happened, there was a blue thing to look at. Nope, oh, it's done. Okay. What was that I've just seen? I feel like I didn't see anything. Oh, look, it's got a face. It's got, like, a beak. Was that there before? Oh, cool. Wait, it's got eyes in its hands. It's, uh, it's friggin' Pan's Labyrinth. Oh, wait, if this is Skyrim, I have to check every single one of these for stuff, for, like, cheese and tomatoes and stuff. Which you'd think would have gone bad by now, but apparently not. Oh, can I walk on this? Should I walk on this? I feel like this thing doesn't want, <laughs> doesn't want me to, like, 
be hanging out right on his crotch. I wouldn't. Uh, I can't really interact with it in any way. This is all very strange. Let's hop on down off his knee. Ha! Okay, that's freaky and... Doesn't seem to be able to do anything. Let's check out his butt. Is there anything on his butt? No. Alright, well, this has been fun. Check out this tomb. This crypt. This grave or what have you. Guess not. Wait, what's back here? Nothing. Alright, let's give it a little look-see this way. What's this? Hey, we got an eye. We got an eye, everybody. Oh, and we got another star up here, too. This isn't where I came from, is it? It might be. Oh, there's the stairs. It is. God damn it. Yeah, all right, okay, yeah. All right, well, let's 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 keep looking. Uh, there's nothing up there. Except, oh, hey, there's more of uh, this that, that thing, the beak thing. Beaks. Also, is its front beak getting longer? The top beak getting longer? This thing, it seems different every time I look at it, and it might just be because I'm getting you, like I'm becoming more familiar with it. Oh, God, no. All of this is bad. This, no. Just no. Please. Oh, you know what I didn't even talk about yet? I didn't even talk about the fact that I have a job now. Like a, like a real, a big boy job. I can't believe I didn't talk about that yet. Uh, yeah, I got a job. I have been looking for one for a while and I finally got one. So, it's an IT position. So I'm doing that. Whoa, that's very glowy. That's... Very cool and glowy. Hey, let me change turn this off. There we go. Doesn't do much. Cool. But yeah, so uh, one day soon, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, my fiance, that's right, I have a fiance, and I will um, uh, get a house. That's the whole point of this, is for me to get a house, so. Uh, this stonework seems weak. Sure does. So wait, does that mean I'm supposed this to. This wall seems weak. I think I can tear it down with some effort. Then do that. I can see light coming through a crack in the wall. The other side is probably hollow. Yeah, so break it. Looks like this wall could be teared down with an effort. Teared it down? I don't know about that. Uh, what, am I supposed to push something down to it then? Because I can't interact. That's probably the case. Hey, what's this now? What's this now? <gasps> Ooh! Okay. Okay. I don't know what this is. I I want to look at one of the fronts of them. All right, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that each one of these things are like a symbol. And I'll have to line them up with something. I found five pieces of stone with different glyphs on them. Oh, Jesus. Hey, sorry about your stomach there, guy. I know you're probably full on weird glyphs, but... I, I, I took those glyphs. They're mine now. You can't have them. Heh. Oh, there's a wall here. I'll get away <laughs> somehow. Uh, okay. Anyway, where was I? Oh, examining the room? Sure. Uh, okay, that's a dead end. <laughs> I can't move anywhere. Great. I'm, uh, I, I, I love when stuff like that happens when you're like, all right, time to move on, and you just can't. Okay, which way was the, uh, uh, which way was the thing? Oh, it was there. Okay. So there's the wall. Oh, she, oh, there's a lot of crumbly, by the way, and I think it's my um, feet. I think it's my feet on the on the on the old rock, rock floor. Can't be sure though. What else? What else do we got? We have this thing. Uninteresting. We have this thing. N more near and root. No, it's not near and root. Hey, this is huge. This place is so big. Have, it's like in Minecraft where you find. You you come up on like a cavern. Uh oh. Oh jeez. Oh, we're getting weird again. And it just ends up being bigger than you should. It should be. And you just run. I'm done talking about Sky Skyrim. No, I'm not. Uh oh. Hey, there's another uh this. Also from Alien. Hmm. If I am not mistaken. You're not. This relief depicts that the overgrown floor we came across at the various points in the cavern, uh, can be cleared away with an iridescent device, a tool or a talisman. Does it? Does it show that? Curiously, we still haven't been able to find the roots of those plants. They seem to 
seep out of these caverns by passing through crevices which look as if intentionally made for them. Huh. That's bizarre. <laughs> what other secrets might these silent halls conceal from us? I don't know. I should take a step back there, though, guy. Freaking me out. Oh, he's gone. I didn't mean to insult you. Okay. So what, I need a iridescent thing? Is it this? Journal has been updated. It's probably just that that thing that we just saw. Uh, we just heard. About the overgrown fauna. Cool. Good news. I don't know how that helps me right now, though. Um, This whole situation is bizarre. It, oh, here we go. Let's do this again. Lay it on me. Hit me with it. As we plan, oh, there's three of them. My team will continue exploration through there's the four stairway. of them. Other expedition parties can commence when ready. Yep, I'm ready. Talk to me. Okay. Oh, they're gone. <laughs> Great. That was, uh... That was informative. Uh, so we got some spiky rocks here. Is this where the uh, old plant was and it like solidified? Hey, look, there's light coming through here. Is this where um, the other side of that wall that I couldn't get through? Does that make sense? Does the geography of this make sense? I don't think so. I don't, I don't, I don't think a lot of anything right now. Oh, here we go. That's going to be something, and we'll deal with it in the next episode, guys. Thank you for watching. Tune in in two days for more Mr. Red Plays, Canarium. And I am going to go and read up on ancient rock mythology, because I feel like that'll help. Glyphs and whatnot. Until then, I've been Mr. Red, and thanks for watching. I hope to see you again. Stay spooky out there, everybody.